Hi everyone and welcome to my channel Lilies and Blush. My name is Suzanne and thank you so much for joining me for today's video which is my weekly melting basket empties and then I'll be going over my upcoming melting basket. Let's dive into it. So first we have Marauder's Map Pumpkin Bread from Fantasy Wax. This was really good in the bathroom actually because like the cinnamon and everything like it wasn't super like the bread smells definitely there it definitely smells like pumpkin bread but it wasn't too like baked goody for the bathroom um and then edward scissor hands from fantasy wax fresh pumpkin and caramel swirls yeah this was the one that was in the bedroom it was so strong um really good pumpkin smell and then we have all three waxy wonders pumpkin pecan waffles vanilla butter fudge espresso oh my gosh this like filled the whole house with like the super like yeah i want to say yeah butter yeah and this was the one that was like super buttery like really strong buttery smell definitely was almost giving me like buttery popcorn vibes like caramel butter popcorn or something um, but super strong, like basically filled up the whole house and I melted that in the living room and normally I struggle to fill up the living room. Um, but we have had the windows closed lately cause it has been chillier. So that could be part of that. Um, fantasy wax, Adam's family, frosted pumpkin cupcake. Ooh, yeah. I'm remembering. Yeah. This was the one that my husband really loved in the bedroom. And then we have, I put a spell on you uh, from L3 Waxy Wonders, cinnamon, sugar, not spicy cinnamon, French baguette with our top secret bakery bomb blend. This was so good too and really strong in the living room. North Pole breakfast. This was another one. Oh my gosh. It definitely made me want IHOP so badly. Uh, North Pole breakfast, pumpkin, pecan waffle, maple syrup, and cider. So amazingly good in the living room. Um, a lot of bags for this one. Fantasy Wax Rocky Horror Picture Show Bourbon Sea Salt Caramel. This was really good in the bedroom. The bourbon is not like that super alcohol smell. It was great. Um, L3 Waxy Wonders, I put a spell on you. This is the same as the other one. It was just a different shape, like a bigger shape. Um, so good. Did it in the living room again. and uh, It was amazing. Uh, Fantasy Wax 13 Ghost Mold Cider. Absolutely loved this in the bathroom. It was so good for the bathroom. Oh absolutely definitely a fave like must buy again kind of scent um sassy girl aroma excuse me i hop pumpkin pecan waffles maple syrup and brown sugar caramel coffee i had like a straight week of like i need to go to i hop i need to have pancakes and waffles and syrup and all of that because of this and then like the other ones like oh my gosh so good in the living room um, the Burrow Buttermilk Pie, L3 Waxy Wonders, Fresh Baked Cinnamon Roll with Extra Brown Sugar, Vanilla Frosting, Vanilla Custard, Sugar Cookie, Cream Brule, Cream, Creme Brulee, oh my gosh, Pie Crust. Uh, so good in the living room, another really strong one. L3 really comes through when, um, I mean, I think, I don't think I've really struggled too much with L3, but definitely really came through right now in this season versus over the summer it was like there but it wasn't crazy strong any of the scents i melted this summer but going into fall i think having the doors and the windows closed has helped um fantasy wax and then i don't have the heater on yet either so it's that like in between time where there's nothing affecting the room um no air or movement or whatever um fantasy wax graham's kitchen i did this one in the bathroom it was a good bathroom scent Amish Harvest from Wit and Wax, Fresh Picked Pumpkin, Dried Apples, and Dark Berries with Clove and Cinnamon. Another good bathroom scent that I really enjoyed. Um, ooh, I'm losing the pile. Uh, Cider Lane from Fantasy Wax. Another one of those cider ones that I'm absolutely obsessed with now. Loved it in the bathroom. Uh, L3 Waxy Wonders Sorting Hat. Uh, smells like breakfast in the Great Hall. Sweet Apple Cinnamon Pumpkin our uh, pecan waffles and rich vanilla syrup another one that made my house smell like i wanted to go to breakfast and then sunday brunch added to that as well from sassy girl aroma i had two of these this was my second one and i'm absolutely obsessed with it definitely would repurchase um when it's up for sale again i got this as a d stash along with the other one i melted so 
Um, if she ever redoes this scent, I will definitely buy it again. Cinnamon toast, bacon, pancakes, and maple syrup. And then uh, fantasy wax, zucchini bread, and pumpkin corn waffles. Again, another scent that like, seriously, it was like a week or two weeks of just like my house smelling like delicious breakfast foods and it definitely like made me just want breakfast foods every day uh casper from fantasy wax maple toddy vanilla rum this was also really good in the bedroom roadhouse rolls freaking amazing wit and wax uh freshly baked dinner rolls topped with whipped honey butter and cinnamon i've talked about this several times in my obsession with the texas roadhouse rolls and the butter the cinnamon honey butter whatever it is that they put together to go with the rolls it's freaking amazing and that smelled just like it Ooh, and my husband loved it too uh fantasy wax unforgivable curse pumpkin cotton waffle i feel like i've all did everything pumpkin cotton waffle um pumpkin cotton waffle sweet potato brown sugar super good absolutely loved uh fantasy wax scream rich musk pear and hint of nuts another really good one for the bathroom uh, fantasy wax Halloween candy corn this smelled amazing and it almost didn't exactly smell like it's only like candy corn and then it also smelled like something else that was delicious but seriously this was like number one I was like when I was smelling it I was like I put the candy corn one in like that's so freaking good so it was in the bedroom it was just amazing um, and then we have Sassy Girl Aroma Haunted Leaves, Sweet Leaf Greens, Fresh Pines, Dewy Spice Florals, and Earth and Musk. Super yummy in the living room. Uh, Fantasy Wax Nightmare on Elm Street, Apple Butterscotch Cake. This one was really good in, I think I might have done this one in the bathroom. Trying to get some like baked goods that aren't over the top baked good in there. Sassy Girl Aroma Black Hood, Woodsy, and Sweet Smoky Vanilla. This was amazing. I absolutely love this one so much. Definitely a repurchase. Um, and then Fantasy Wax It Funnel Cake. Really good. My husband loved as usual. So that is all the empties. I'm going to set that aside. And then this is the basket for this week. Another definitely loaded basket. So we have, um, and it's definitely, will last me more than just all week uh <laughs> at least two um south band candle code co oh, i cannot speak i'm trying to talk really fast southbound candle co sticky s'mores graham crackers melted chocolate toasted marshmallows and the smell of a smoky fall bonfire in the air so it's just smell like you're making s'mores mm, that smells really good definitely getting the chocolate smell right there so excited about that definitely will inspire me to get some s'mores we're finally getting that fall weather here in washington um then we have warm and cozy smells like your favorite freshly washed sweater mm, i love that smell it's like a clean like freshly clean sweater smell oh so good i'm not gonna smell all of these probably but um death and decay from that small good shop jasmine lang lang and rose lush type scents and then we have terror tower from villainous wax tonka bean sandalwood smoke french cigarettes and falling elevators i love the smell of this one mm. oh, that leather smell seriously is a babe all right i'm going through the first basket first okay or the first half of the basket uh, welcome to Woodsboro. Sweet tobacco, fallen leaves, apple, and a slight smell of blood. I don't smell the blood, but I smell everything else. <laughs> uh, and then we have Old Town Bake Shop from Fantasy Wax. This is a freebie. Super good. I think I've already melted this bigger scent of that, but maybe I haven't. Uh, Fantasy Wax Pretzel and Cider Donut. This one is so good. Mm, I love the salty with this sweet of like the donut it's so good country gift shop mm, i just love these fall smells from fantasy wax they're just amazing some more pumpkin pecan waffle and pretzel i'm excited about like a salty pumpkin pecan waffle after all the like super sugary pumpkin pecan waffle um fantasy wax pumpkin apple butter super good too 
excited about that one the bus to nowhere from that small good shop campfire mahogany flannel just a really good like you know manly musky smell mm, it just smells like clean manly ugh awesomeness honey buttered rolls need i say more and then we have ghoul berry from fantasy wax which i love this one it's such a good berry scent mm, it's like a taffy it reminds me of like blueberry taffy or something i'm gonna pile this whoop, back in here real quick dumping it all back and then the middle we have fantasy wax haunted mansion blueberry pumpkin patch this is one of my faves last year it just smells oh, so freaking good and then we have fantasy wax swift sweat of a ghost so more booberry i'm excited about that absolutely love that one um we have the winchester brothers Warm flannel, gunpowder, black pepper, and babies stainless steel. Love it. Uh, and then we have Fantasy Wax, The Bad Thing. Vanilla pumpkin, marshmallow, pumpkin con waffles. So some more sweet pumpkin con waffles. Uh, then we have Grandma Aggie from Fantasy Wax. Sweet cinnamon and pumpkin bath and body works type. Yeah. I was... <laughs> I'm like, my brain is just not functioning. Fantasy Wax, Hair of a Werewolf, Pumpkin Pretzel Latte. Oh, this one smells so good. Mm. The salty with the latte is just, oh, so good. Okay, uh, Fantasy Wax, Fang of a Vampire, Frankenberry. Another, like, wonderful berry scent. Mm. My husband will love that. And then we have Apple Cider Donuts. I love apple cider smells. Like the Mac apple smell, I feel like is one of my top favorite smells of fall. Just like give me all the apple. And then pumpkin spice latte. It smells so good. Mm. So freaking good, man. Makes me want one right now. Okay. Let me throw these back in here. And then we'll go on to the last section. If we can get everything to fit back in. <laughs> I was like, I don't know how I got it all to fit in there in the first place. So bear with me. Okay. Oh gosh, all the big chunks. So we have here's Jenny Cinnamon Sugar from L3 Waxy Wonders. Pumpkin Palm Waffle Pretzel Bakery Bomb. More pumpkin palm waffle. Got the PPW on lock, man. <laughs> I love pretzel and the bakery bomb scent from L3 is just amazing. Southbound Candle Co. Magical Menagerie. Herbal Lavender, Palo Santo, and Smoky Vanilla. Ugh, I'm looking forward to some heavy, musky, manly scent. Mm, the Wonder. The Amazing. <sighs> that Palo Santo and the Smoky. Mm, so good. Crisp Apple, Ice Wine, and Mulberry from L3. Oh, I could just like... Ugh. Makes me want to try, like, mulberry wine. I don't think I've ever tried mulberry wine. Um, and then we have pretzel and pecan, pumpkin pecan waffles. So I actually have two of those. Um, and so excited about that, of course. And then we have L3 Waxy Wonder Sleepy Hollow. Vanilla pound cake with pumpkin cream filling and cream cheese frosting. So just, like, amazing baked scent. Mm. Pumpkin spice, man. And that pumpkin cream. That definitely sounds like the type of pumpkin dessert I would like better than pumpkin pie, probably. I feel like I'm, I'm like, out pumpkin pied at this age. Like, I've been eating pumpkin pie for, like, most of my life. And after 32 years of pumpkin pie, I think I'm ready for other pumpkin-type desserts other than just the pie. But, you know, it's still good, though. Uh, okay, so that's it. That's the basket. Uh, so... Yeah, we'll see in the empties how I feel about all of these guys once they're on warm, but on cold, they're pretty great so far, so we'll see. Uh, thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!